Surprise! It's me again. Going to show you how to do some single step equations using multiplication and division. All right. So the first thing to remind you again is in equations, inverse means opposite. It says to multiply. We ain't going to multiply. We're going to divide. If it says divide, we're going to multiply, brother. Now, first one I'm going to zoom in on here. Oops. Six times M equals 42. Says times. Let me first set up my lines. Always use the lines. It helps set, keep everything separated. Six times M. Now, when it says times, I just told you, bro, we're going to divide. Six divided by six. 42 divided by six. Whatever I do to the left, I got to do to the right. 6 divided by 6 is 1. The M is still there. Now, that is a waste of time, but I wanted to show you the first time. When you have 1 and a letter, it just means 1 times the letter. So, 1 times anything is itself. So, don't waste your time by writing 1M. You just need to write M. 42 divided by 6 on the other side is 7. And there's my answer. M equals 7. How do I know? Because if I go back to the top, 6 times, I said 7, is 42. You know you're right. Now, if I slide over to the other side, this says F divided by 4. Most kids think this is a fraction, but a fraction is just a division problem, so don't freak out. We're going to set it up with our lines. It says divide by four. No, homie, we ain't gonna, we're gonna multiply. Why multiply? Because we want this F all alone. We want it to just be F. So F is gonna equal, and don't get ahead of yourself here. The reason why we say divide and then multiply, if I had two apples, and I divide it by two, and then I times it by two, I'm right back to the two apples I had. So divide by four times by four is just a waste of time. If I said, hey, add four cookies to the basket, now take four cookies out of the basket, how many do you have? Why'd you wait, make me waste my time, bro? I still have the same amount of cookies as I started with. Zero, because I ate them all. So if I go back to the right side, I have negative eight times four. One negative, Use the old triangle trick. One negative. Oops. The first one's negative, so I cross it off. The second one's positive, so I cross off the positive. The only thing that's left is a negative, so I know my answer, bro, is going to be negative. And 8 times 4 is 32. F equals negative 32. F equals negative 32, brother. That's all I got, guys. Check you later.